Here's your daily dose of fitness, food, and fun. Angelica's daily surprise starts now. My butt is eating my pants. Can you see that? I'm coughing up a hairball. Press it up. Ooh, my shoulders are cracking. Good morning, baby. Hey there. Did you know that you don't need to spend hours in the gym and pump ridiculous amounts of weight to get ripped? Well, surprise! Today I'm here to guide you through a quick high intensity interval training workout that'll burn at least 100 calories in just under 15 minutes. Seriously, you won't believe how much positive change you can create in your body using just little itty bitty five pound weights. Don't believe me? Well, let's get started then, huh? Now, let me explain what a high intensity interval training workout is for those of you that don't know. Basically, we're taking three circuits. Each circuit has three exercises. We're gonna do each exercise for 30 seconds and we're going to repeat it twice. Sound a little bit confusing? Well, you don't have to worry because you have me to guide you through it. Let's get the music going. All right, first exercise of the first circuit. We're gonna do a nice squat, bringing the arms up, and we're going to press it up. Ooh, my shoulders are cracking. Good morning, baby. Squat, drive it up. Now you either wanna go slow and steady or you wanna press it up. So it's up to you. But the descent into the squat has to be smooth. Last one. Very good. Drop one of those weights. Now we're gonna do a squat with a twist as you press. Here we go, 30 seconds. Now, when you extend that arm, you wanna make sure it's going right by the ears. Pull those abdominals in. Just cause we're not doing crunches, doesn't mean the abs aren't working. Last two. Last one. Good. Let's do the other side right away. Twist, nice and strong. Swivel that ball of the foot into the floor. Come back. You're more than halfway through. 10 seconds left. Keep those knees over the toes, chest lifted, optimistic, <laughs> and you're done. Good, now, we are not working with a kettlebell today, but we're gonna do kettlebell swings using our dumbbells. So we're gonna glue the dumbbells together. You're gonna swing it back and forward. So this is even a little bit more challenging than using a kettlebell because we're working on keeping the weights pressed together so your triceps are working. You're coming to about heart level. A few more seconds left. This is our cardio and one. Very good. That was round one of the first circuit. Let's do that all over again. So this is our repeater here. Curl it up, squat. Squats are one of the most effective ways for shaping the entire lower body. Again, making sure those arms come right up by the ears. Smooth, consistent movement. Last one. Good, drop that weight. Fix your hair. Here we go. 
squat with a press and a twist. This move makes me feel powerful. I'm working my entire arm. You got about 10 seconds left. My butt is eating my pants. Can you see that? <laughs> That's what you want. <laughs> Good. Let's do the other side. We're almost done that first circuit. After this, we have our kettlebell swings without the kettlebell. You should be sweating. Last few seconds. And one. Good. This time, I'm just gonna use one weight to do the kettlebell. I'm gonna hold it by the base, and this time, I'm just swinging out. So this is another option, too. So you can use both weights or one. Just make sure you don't send the weight lying through the TV. We don't want that. Nice, decisive, sharp movements for five, four, three, two, and one. Very good. That's the end of the first circuit. Okay, now we're working on that cleavage. Okay, now we're doing something called sweethearts. We're working the pecs, bring the weights in front of you. We're lifting the elbows, tapping the base of the weights, and then drawing a beautiful little heart and tapping it below by the belly button. So you're carving, sculpting those tatas down. Keep the abs strong, nice and flexed. I call these sweethearts, but they're not sweet. They're very hard. And last one. Good. All right, this is one of my favorite upper body exercises. It hits all muscles in the arms here. Again, standing in a nice, strong, powerful stance. You're gonna bring the elbows into the body. We are going to open, lift the elbows, extend, up. Come down to 90, drop the weight down, pull the elbows in, and close the show. So it's eight parts. One, two, shoulders dropped, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight. Last one. One, two. Chest open. Three. Shoulders down. Four. All right. And now it's time for the final move of the second circuit. Bring the bottoms of those weights together. We're just going to trace down the leg and squeeze back up. So you want to. Feel the posterior chain firing up here. Keep the chest lifted. You can see my face is up. I'm not dropping the head. I'm holding the abdominals. We've got about 10 seconds left here. Use the heels to drive into the ground and lift you up. And last one. Very good, okay, so that was the first time we've done the second circuit, let's do that again. Moving into sweethearts, starting now. You're strong, you're powerful, you're using those biceps. Every exercise I do works multiple muscle groups because that's how we save time. Right? We're busy. We've got places to go. We can't be spending all of our time in the gym all day. Here we go, last one. 
right away. Moving into one, two, three, four, five, six, controlled, and eight. Open it up. Two, inhale, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One more set. One, two, <laughs> three, four, five, six, seven. Down the leg and down and up. A down and up. So if you ever repeat this workout down the line, you'll get more accustomed to the flow of the exercises and you can just go right into them. 15 seconds left here. Stretched legs, work that pelvis, squeeze it under. And rest, good. We are now in our third and final circuit. Yay, go you. We're gonna pick up the weights, separate the legs, get into a nice second position, plie, and we're gonna bring the arms up. And we're just going to reach out on the diagonal and reach out on the diagonal. Here we go. So this is obliques, arms, tops of the shoulders, glutes, like I said, I don't like to waste my time. We're doing a full body workout, and I promised you at least 100 calories burned, right? Seven seconds left. And last one. Good, come out of that. Parallel legs. We're just doing frontal raises up one and two. Good. Try not to let momentum lead this. You want slow, controlled, deliberate. Pushing the chest forward, past the arms, holding those abs. Don't forget about the butt. You're still squeezing that too. When in doubt, squeeze the bootay. We've got about five seconds left. Five, four, three, two, and one. Finishing off this first round of the third circuit, we're gonna punch. I'm bringing my leading leg forward. I'm punching, punching. This is hard. This is our big finisher. Punch, punch. So I'm twisting and recoiling. Ugh. Full arms. Your arms should be burning. Three, two, one. Good. Repeat that third circuit from the beginning. One more time. Deep second position plie. Bring the arms up and we're reaching. Shoulders down. Keep those arms lifted. You're more than halfway through. Stay with me. This is it. This is where we make all that positive change. Get lower in the legs. Grit those teeth. Three, two, one. Very good. Frontal raises. Working that pec. Those pecs, you have two. <laughs> One at a time you're working the pecs. Oh, yes. We're almost at the finish line and it feels so good. Use every last ounce of energy you've got for four, three, two, and one. Good. Punch it out one last time. Woo! I'm going to lead with the other leg. Put him up. Put him up. Hmm. -hmm. Here we go. Boom. 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 Do you like my sound effects? I do that when I'm alone. <laughs> I should really stop doing it when I'm on camera. I'm like, Pew! 
Woo! <laughs> Anything to distract me. Five, four, three, two, and one. Drop those weights delicately. You just saved yourself hours in the gym. You can probably eat whatever you want now. That's been Angelica's daily surprise. Go show off those new muscles. 